The purpose of this tutorial today is to answer one of the questions that I received on my YouTube platform. And what the person basically wanted to know was that we did a crop from shape and they wanted to save the image. And they wanted to do so without a white background. So what we're going to do now is I'm going to go back and do that from scratch by first double clicking on the picture so that I get the format contextual tab. Next, I'm going to look in the size group. I'm going to click on the drop down arrow under crop and I'm going to say crop to shape. In this case, I'm going to select the heart again. And if I were to move this image um, by copying it, I could instantly go to a presentation type of software like PowerPoint and paste it. And you can see there is no background surrounding this particular heart. So the next thing I'm going to do is I'm going to go back to the document and in this case, if the person doesn't want to use the PowerPoint presentation and they wanted to save this image, the way they could do it is they could do a search on their computer and type in snipping. There is a snipping tool that would let you capture this image that was just cropped. So I have this automatically saved on my taskbar. I'm going to click it. Next, I'm going to click new and I'm going to hover by clicking and dragging over this image and next I'm going to save it. I'm going to save it as file save as and I'm going to click heart and I'm going to save it. It'll ask me a question and I'll tell it yes. The next thing I'm going to do is go back to PowerPoint because I want you to see what's happened here. If I were to select insert it's not obvious when you look at this because the background's not present. But if you were to take that image that was just saved and you clicked on pictures and you went back to downloads and double clicked on heart, you could see that white background is present. And that's what the person wants to get rid of. There is a free tool available online that can help you remove this white background. So what you would do is click on a tool such as Chrome. I'm going to type in lunapic.com and press enter. On this particular website, there is a quick upload feature. So you could click on that. Next, you would select choose file and you would double click on the image that you want to edit. You'll notice that the image is present. And next, what you could do is look in the menu section, hover over the area called edit, move all the way to the bottom and select transparent background. What's nice is all you have to do is just click on the background that you want to remove and now it has been deleted. You're left with the shape of what you created in Microsoft Word. Now you can click on save. In this case, I'm going to say name it this heart again and I'm going to save it as a PNG file. And the next thing I'm going to do, one, I'm going to open this file so that you can see it. You can see what this looks like here. But more importantly, I'm going to go back to the PowerPoint presentation. I'm going to add in another slide. And next, I'm going to click on Insert, Pictures. And now I'm going to go back to that folder. And in this case, I need the one that has the PNG, which is this one. So I'm going to double click it and now you can see you have that heart with the white ground, the white background removed. So that's how you would do it if you crop the image from Microsoft Word. Thanks for watching.